Yeah, I'll meet you, sir. My name is Fred Mayor Oshola. People call me Oma Baru. Yeah, Oma What do you do, sir? I'm a media man. I'm a media consultant, and I fellowship in the church. Okay. As a co-fellowship in the church, the the program, the six days program, we just that we're concluding today. What would you say is your view about it? How would you describe wow. it? Wow. In French, the, when the Frenchman is thrilled, he simply says, "Oh la 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 la." And when the French, when the Englishman is thrilled, you find that word, "Wow." It is simply awesome. This last six days of glory has really brought out the glory of God to the masses within this environment and um, it, has it has been able to bring about revival. It has been able to open up the hearts of people on the need to fellowship with God, to take their burdens and challenges to God in the place of worship, in the place of prayer. And you know, the, 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 the climax of it all is this Sunday service of uh, praise extravaganza it is indeed a praise extravaganza i am wild i am slain in the spirit i am excited okay i think that is a thing of joy but we would like to ask no matter how we do as humans there are still chances of we having some imperfections so what are those things you feel we need to improve on in case of some subsequent time well i feel that this kind of program should not just be a seasonal program it should be a program that will take place every so often because i believe that the biblical model that christ has set for the body of christ for the church to be specific is for the church to take church to the people not for the church to await the people to come to church if you read the bible the synoptic gospels matthew luke mark and john what our lord commanded is that we should go into all the world and preach the gospel but you find that in, in today's uh, model, in, in, the, in the church system, you find that people tend to tell people, you people should come on into the church. Look at today's service taking place in the ambience, almost by the roadside. There are people who naturally would not go to church. But by finding out that, wow, this is church near me. So I want to advise that as much as possible, the church should try to move closer to the people. Subsequent outreaches should endeavor to come closer to the people that advantage of proximity taking the gospel to the people where they are will actually help the church to reach out to the world more because we can never be wiser than the master he gave us the model and if we want to achieve the optimal results with the mandate that he has given us there is no better model to adopt than the model given and commanded by the master okay because of our time we'd like to say thank you for giving your, us My your time pleasure thank we're you very, very grateful thank you so much sir